crash uh -huh. if that skin is on his screen. Really? And when I mean crash, it'll hard online. It'll hard crash his, his opponent's rivals. <laughs> And oh, I think it even crashes their computer. It's like, really? It's such a weird bug, but it's it's such a good skin. Hashtag and game maker. <laughs> hashtag game maker. Ah, uh, yes, got to practice uh, getting the ice down on the field. Very important, very important. Also, the baby dash jabs. Which, honestly, can be really big for Edelis with how much you slide on that ice. Oh, I mean, yeah, like, Edelis can get, like, at all, like that ice gives that also the ability to like zoom across screen, yeah. but it also gives them that ability to do that, the little micro spacing yeah. that like, like, like similar to like the way moonwalks kind of you can kind of get like, yeah. you still get that slide, but just a little bit type yeah. of thing. It's just watching them both slide and dash. Yep. I mean, the scariest thing about Atlas is that the ice makes him the fastest ground movement character in the game, mm -hmm. even faster than Ori. That's saying something. Yeah, like I think the only character that might come close, honestly, might even be just like Raster and Slipstream, but that's it, Raster yeah. and Aaron Slipstream. Yeah. And the sad thing is, that's still slower. That's how fast Ellis <laughs> moves on that ice. That man is zooming. Yeah, I mean, a heavy body character that moves that fast is almost unheard of in any fighting game. Oh, yeah. But All Temkin's right. out there dreaming. <laughs> <laughs> Tager's like, what is movement? <laughs> All right, so going to Gates, game one, Edelis ditto. This is honestly one of the more frustrating dittos because it's like the very thing you want to do, put an ice on the ground, is the very thing your opponent wants. You're essentially giving your opponent the same advantage you're giving yourself. Mm -hmm. What's also funny is Edelis has one of the best ways of dealing with Edelis edge guard. True. <laughs> because of the uh, the uppy having anti-projectile properties all. Yep. And the verticality the up B gives you, you can just go up there and edge guard the Edelis up high. There's no escaping the opposing Edelis when you're off stage. Especially, and Edelis also has the big fair armor, which a lot of characters do not yeah. have aerial armor. Yeah. So, can dodge the projectiles, then armor moves, like, he's an anti him. Yeah. That's a funny thing. A lot of the dittos are just like, it's your own worst enemy. Mm -hmm. uh, but right now, uh, Chomper's worst enemy is definitely Soul Rifle. Yeah, I mean, the punish is Soul Rifle is getting off stage, just pushing Chompers to the edge of the screen, the edge of what they can do to get back, constantly pairing these icicles. Soul Rifle is just running a clinic on how to play this character against itself. Right, yeah. And that's the thing, it's hard to, it's hard to make it seem like Chompers oh does God. not know how to play Atlas. Like, it is. This man knows more about Edelis than, like, anyone. Yeah. He loves this character. There we go. There we go. No heavy body. Still Good there. DI, yeah. At least gives Choppers an opportunity to get some ice armor here, so going to be able to keep the stock alive a little longer. I like right. the, just hopping down there, threatening to come up after Soul Rifle. <laughs> and there we go, abusing the armor there to make sure that Strong Attack is able to close out that stock. Ooh, nice. Good use of the armor there on the on the up B2. Get yeah. back. Living at 180 all the way up there. Oh, tries to catch him off guard with the lower icicles, but so rifle is ready for those. Gets to the parry again and just closes out that game one. Yeah, and not as much on this stage, because long platform, not as much. One yep. thing, if you ever watch Chomper's sets, yep. when he's trying to land, he'll throw those those uh, those icicles. Yep. He's trying to actually bait a parry. Huh. He wants you to parry. So that way he can just edge cancel off of a platform, uh, and then he gets to land for free because you're worrying about pairing icicles. That's true, that's true. Um, but with those big platforms, a little bit hard. <laughs> <laughs> Gentlemen's icicle, understandable. They essentially just did the exact same stuff. I, I always, I, that's the fun part in the ditto is when like, each person does the exact same thing, it's the hive mind. Yep, Craig's, you pull out the rocks. I Adelis's, you uh, pull out the rocks. Cool. A little bit closer start this time. Chopper's kind of getting some going. Still down on percent. Still trying to. Oh, nice read there. Using that down be kind of weird coverage. Yep. Good tech. <laughs> oh my Just god. Just bullying him off stage there. What was like, all jab, jab, tilt, jab, tilt, tilt, jab, tilt. Yeah, and you're on. <laughs> what was the last time you saw Idolus F tilt kill? <laughs> Uh, unfortunately, right now, but it feels like it shouldn't. It's just a zoning tool. Yeah. And yeah, here it is killing on uh, Rockwall, the stage with no side of the stage. It's just edge blast zone. That's oh. all it is. Let's be honest here. All right, Chopper's kind of getting something going this time. Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh no. 
Okay, okay. got out of it, got out of it. We're good, we're good. Oh, Ooh, sits on him. Nice good tech. Yep. Oh, nice. Get the fair there. Yep. I like this. Get quick armor. Oh, Ooh. tried to use the shards there to knock the soul rifle back off stage, but soul rifle just a little bit too high there for him. Oh, classic. Nice Gatlin back. Get the confirm. Now that's an interesting option there. Using the down B to clear off the ice so that way soul rifle doesn't have burst options when he gets back on stage. Forced to put down his own ice in order to be able to have that quick movement. Oh, two minutes. Less there than two minutes. Is. Yeah, I mean that is that is Rockwall with that list. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jeez. I okay. mean, Ellis already moves fast enough and, and has a lot of hard hitting moves. The last thing you need is a bear hurtling at you at 100 miles per hour when your back is at the blast zone. Yeah. Like that thing. Like the way Soul Rifle's moving with Ellis. The only other Edelis, like at least in recent times that I've seen moving that quite like that has been Chompers. Yeah. It's just such a highly aggressive, like constantly moving in your face, yeah. getting that going super fast. Yeah. It's and it's frustrating to deal with because a lot of times you want to be able to react to movement in a game like this, but because that movement is so fast, it just puts your mind oh my in so much overheat because of how much you have to focus and just stay aware to act in an instant against them. Down are almost there. That Chompers almost had a very early stock right there, but couldn't quite get the last fair off stage. But very even game this time compared to some of the other ones where it feels like Soul Rifle kind of runs away with the first stock and then just never looks back. Yeah, it feels like having the blast zones a little bit larger and having a little bit more room to move and having the ability for that neutral B to somehow hit, because why not, uh, is definitely making a big opening for Chompers to keep this game even. Yeah. Big fair right there. Yeah, wow. didn't quite get the right the eye. Soul Rifle with armor right here. That's really big. Yeah, going to be able to keep the stock alive a little bit longer. Harder to kill, but easier to combo. But when they're at, never mind. We're going to just fall down in the blast zone. Why not? That is Why the not? most feels Edelus moment of you go, you fall off True. stage and while yeah. doing a fair, and you just die. Yep. Oh, no. Now here comes the hard part, like you said. His own worst enemy, just being able to throw out those icicles and bully that recovery, but Chopper is no stranger to having to mix up their recovery options, able to make it back. Yeah. Right now, Soul Rifle's got a pretty solid, solid lead on the second stock, but Chopper is not out. He's he's trying to fight right now. He's got something going. Yeah, it's just a matter of making sure that once that thing is going, it just stays going, because it feels like there's a few instances like that right there where you just overextend a little bit, trying to push the issue, get yourself back in the game, and then all of a sudden, Soul Rifle's got that strong weight for you to take that stock away because of it. Yeah. Oh, wow, that is aggressive. Went very far down, really. Because that's the thing, you, you're, when you go down like that, you're trying to catch him off guard super quickly. Yeah. Oh, big fair. Using that armor. Oh! I'm not gonna lie, I thought someone was about to die right there. I mean, when they're both in the ball, it's the only logical thing to think of because you can't be fighting up that high and not expect something to happen. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. I think uh, Soul Rifle may have been expecting an up air there trying to chuck him down in the blast zone, but by going for the fair there, catches him DIing in and sends him up into the top blast zone instead. Uh, and while, like, Chompers had that uh, had that armor and was like, honestly, in a good, that's going to be it. Oh. oh just good DI, though. That's... Yeah. Yeah, that's, and Soul Rifle knew he couldn't get an immediate punish, so just kind of went for a read. And while it was a good read, not quite going to kill. Yep. Oh. Nah, that's hard. To, yeah. That fair is so hard to DI because you have to get really into the corner and just... Yeah. Yeah. yeah, sometimes for that move, it feels like the best DI is...